Hey everyone, I just want to give you a quick overview of what you're going to be doing today. And basically you're just going to be identifying the independent variable or the IV is what we call it for short, your dependent variable or your DV and your constants, um, as well as coming up with a list of materials that you need to actually do the experiment. So just a quick reminder for the independent variable, you want to think what is causing the change? Okay, what are we changing about each experimental group to see if there's going to have an effect on that because of that thing? Okay, so again, our independent variable, you're going to type, what are we changing? We are, cha you don't even have to say what we're changing, just literally list it. Think back to the, um, what do you call it? The flower um, experiment that was in the notes. Um, the independent variable for that one was the type of light bulb because, or the type of light source rather, um, because we were saying, okay, we're going to put it under an incandescent, a fluorescent light bulb, and then the sun. So we were changing the type of light source. For this experiment, our paper airplane lab, what are we changing about those paper airplanes? For your dependent variable, you're going to say, what is the change? If we make that change to our paper airplanes, what is the result going to be? Okay, so what is the end um, thing that we're going to be measuring? Um, what are we going to be measuring at the end? Okay, that's our dependent variable. And then the constants are things that have to be kept the same because if we don't keep them the same, they're going to mess up our results. So they would be kind of not similar to, but they're things that we can change like the independent variable, but we don't want to change them because if we do, we won't know if the outcome or the dependent variable is caused because of the independent variable or these other things that we forgot to keep the same. So for the um, flower lab that we saw in our notes, um, some constants that had to happen were they had to be the same type of soil. Okay, if we use different types of soil, in addition to the light source, we wouldn't necessarily know how well the flower grew if it was because of the light source or because of the soil. Um, so those are examples of constants. I want you to come up with and list three constants. So three things that have to be kept the same when we're throwing our paper airplanes. And then down here is the material. So pretty much you're coming up with a list of everything that you think you will need to complete this experiment. This is going to help us when we get to um, the actual experiment day, which is going to be on Monday. Um, it's going to help us to see what you need to take out, what you need to have ready, etc. Okay, so for today, you are only doing these three things, coming up with the independent variable, the dependent variable, the constants, and the materials. Okay, so that is all for today. Again, if you guys have any questions, you can always leave me a private comment, um, and I will get back to you. So have a good one.